Good morning, beautiful people. This is Jason Shades. We're back again with some more good music. And of course, if you know what day it is, I know it happened yesterday, but today we are going to be jumping in on the Ren Kujo beatdown. Um, I am not a big fan of the whole beatdown bullshit, you know, the whole diss um, culture. Not a big fan of this. It's not my thing. But I will tell you, looking at what you know, watching and looking at what Ren's been going through. I think this is pretty nice to only go after him in music because I'm telling, uh, telling you, Cujo just, I don't think he's been punched enough in the face. You know, um, probably didn't get punched enough growing up. You know, it's just my thought because if he's acting this way, yeah. Um, greedy little fucker. It sounds like from everything, you know, we've been diving into. And I'll tell you what, go and check out, I mean, some of the good people who have dived in. And, and I'm not an expert. I'm not a legal kind of guy. Um, there's one of these lawyers that are on it who dug into this. and um, But Anthony Ray did a great job pulling, reading all those t text messages back and forth. It was very enlightening, very, very enlightening of the, the mentality coming from Cujo. But I do want to see what Ren has to say. Um, now, the last time we saw him in a um, gangster rap or a, um, you know, or, or, or battle rap, you know, we haven't, was with King Dada. Now, I'll tell you what. You know, obviously, Ren at that time with King Dada had a certain respect for him, liked his music, liked his rapping abilities and stuff like that, and turned it around. Had all these, you know, doing the battle rap, turned it around and went, hey, man, you're you're sick. Uh, your raps are sick. I like them. Keep doing what you're doing. Okay. I got a feeling he's not going to be turning this around at all. I got a feeling that this is going to be just raw vengeance, anger, Ren. We've not seen this before. So this is going to be really interesting. <laughs> now that's interesting. It's a mimic of a look from... Sick boy. But now it's violently sick boy. Person who is rightly doing right, who is right there on the right, just path no wrong in words are right. But the forces out that test me, ran I'm trying to find the path hmm. to forgive all those who test my will. There's trouble in my heart. What the? <coughs> I gotta admit, I do like. You know, he always does try to do the right thing. He always gives everybody the benefit about of the doubt for everything. You know, as far as everything we've seen of Ren, he's a really upstanding kid, a uh, guy. I, I, I keep calling him a kid. It's not a kid. He's in his 30s. But I will tell you, he's he's a really upstanding um, dude, you know. And the other thing is, is I love his, his quote, you know, the uh, a rising tide lifts all boats. He wants everybody to be lifted up together. He doesn't want, oh, it's just for me, not for you type of mentality. So, I mean, he's a, you can tell he's a really good guy in, in a good heart. But don't piss him off. I'm trying to be the person who is rightly doing right. Who is right there on the righteous path. No wrong in words are right. But the forces out that test me right. I'm trying to find the path and forgive all those who test my will. There's trouble in my heart. What the fuck, you little pussy? This ain't my <laughs> number two. This ain't pendulums or songs of hope that can't talk from you. And the last time we did this, the hope did prevail. Now the hope is the road that will choke a bitch pale. Choke a bitch pale. Damn. I told you, he's getting violent. I mean, to choke a bitch pale, hmm, hey, that's, they're dead. Hmm, hmm, love it. Last time we did this, the hope did prevail. Now the hope is the road that will choke a bitch pale. No, no, just wait, just wait, just wait a sec. Cause there's nothing to be gained when you sever the neck. I know the art is the <laughs> part of your heart, so you're upset. But this hate breeds hate. Please wait, jeez, when. Okay, we're, we're going to go back. I mean, I like that hate breeds hate. 
he's absolutely right you know and with as polarized as we are right now in, in the u.s uh, we're not going to get into it it's not about hate and hate it's about love and love big beatles fan here okay but i love if you watch this and i want you to go and i'm going to put a link down you need to watch this and I, we need to hit we need just to pump it up and, and get these views just massive for Ren. But the thing of it is, is the acting. Oh my God, this kid can act. Um, even in his rapping, even in his singing, this dude can freaking act. I want to, I, it needs to be on Netflix. Just wait, just wait, just wait a sec Cause there's nothing to be gained when you sever the neck I know the art is a part of your heart so you're upset But this hate breeds hate, please wait, jeez when I'm getting pretty sick of the sick boy Trying to be the it boy, trying to be the I'm so morally equipped boy Face it, you're mad as fuck, Ren Now let me cut this worm with my razor blade pen I love this, this is back to Hi Ren He's got the two characters going on This is awesome Fuck it Bad, he surrendered to the bad guy? Telltale tell heart? The heartbeat? Okay. Oh, wait a minute. What the hell is... Oh, wait a minute. Check, check the background out. Holy shit. Okay. Damn, this kid's so talented. Oh my god. I mean, to have a chorus behind him in this... What genre is he not killing it in and mixing and matching? I mean, I'm just always shocked and amazed how, you know, he just goes to the point of so far past just the norm. <laughs> Try to struggle, hear me out. See, I'm on your side, really. Well, I was till I found you could get a little greedy. Push your luck a little far. There's a moral, little Jimmy, of the cookie and the jar. See the needy and the greedy, they're just trying to fill a hole. So they take and then they take and still the empty in their soul. They feel so hard done by poor little you. Wanna take from me, bit? Then I'll take from you too. We're going back because I love the way he was skipping around. I, you know what, the feeling I get on this one is uh, Reservoir Dogs, he's dancing around, going to cut his ear off. Man, is, is, are we going Reservoir Dogs on this? <laughs> I'm excited about that. I love violence. It's on TV. It's fun. Struggle, hear me out. See, I'm on your side, really. Well, I was till I found you could get a little greedy. Push your luck a little far. There's a moral, little Jimmy, of the cookie and the jar. See the needy and the greedy, they're just trying to fill a hole. So they take and then they take us through the empty in their soul. They feel so hard done by poor little you. Wanna take from me, bit? Then I'll take from you, too. <laughs> Kujo's, okay, that's that's got to be the representation of Kujo's girlfriend, who was also reaching out to Ren, and, and it looked like they had it settled, and then all things blew up. Again, go back, watch Anthony Ray, brilliant job at it. But no, this, this, wow. I'm usually against bringing the girlfriend in on any kind of things like this, but she got herself involved in fucking Ren over she deserves it. I'm okay with that. Shut up, slut. You said the night. I thought you said you liked it rough. I thought you said she liked it rough. You're a bitch, man. What the fuck? I'm confused by this dynamic. Like it's Bonnie and it's Clyde, but the killing you're committing is career suicide. Whoa, guys. You probably think that this is extreme. I won't lie. Maybe yeah. just a little bit mean, you know. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, but that is, you know, and if you've known Ren, if you've been watching his interviews and stuff, oh yeah, he's all about, you know, 
the greed monsters fuck them you know eat the rich type of thing oh, it really nah, i'm only messing lad i love to spank the greedy fam i hope you wake up sweating from your nightmare scene i'm the sick boy that you enslave free me when you fuck with my work you might as well bleed me i put yep. my whole soul into my words legally now a oh. little thief one beef one steal from me that's how little thief lose teeth you meal to me i'm the subject matter you are part of the scenery this is how the sick boy work you feeling me Hun, i'm sick with the wow i loved the 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 voice i mean it sounded demonistic part of the scenery this is how the sick boy work you feeling me Hun, i'm sick with the pen i went easy on the daughter he's a friend at zen but if i ever hear your mouth speak the name of ren out in public then it's public you don't want that again and no warning for your bitch of a girlfriend too miss is nice behind the scenes poor cujo boo -hoo. if i ever read another fucking comment from you then this is only part one it's even worse than part two Oh man. Damn. And you should be dealt with on a personal basis. I do not condone abuse or bullying. You it, you know, yeah. And I, I agree. Don't don't go after Cujo. This is between the two of them. I mean, let's be honest. Ren's got a million people who can, you know trash him and I'm, I'm not about that either um but i have to admit i did like the song and that was very very fun um and like he even said he didn't do this to dada you know dada's a friend you're not you pissed him off to the extreme and if go ahead mention his name once and there's going to be an episode two of this song and you know what we know Ren loves multiple songs. You know, I mean, Money Game 1, 2, and 3. You know, I mean, do you really want to be a Cujo beatdown? 2, 3, 4, 5, 6? Because I got a feeling he would do it. But with that, it, this has been fun. This is absolutely exciting to watch. But with that, it's definitely time to go. And uh, you have a great day. Bye-bye.